Right then guys, um, I've been saying I'm going to do these two 20kV potential transformers for a long time and to be honest the only reason I haven't done it is because I haven't had any decent tools to be able to do any of the wire crimp and everything and as it's been Christmas the only thing that was on my Christmas list was tools so I've now got proper wire cutters and a decent set of crimpers and some whatevers and you know I've got myself some rather nice screwdrivers um, so obviously the first thing I wanted to do was come up here and try what I've been uh, wanting to try myself for a long time so this is the babbling and I wanted to do something different guys I didn't want to do a Jacob's Ladder everyone's seen Jacob's Ladders they're a bit boring um, to be honest I couldn't really think of anything that I can set up quick enough just for me to see these transformers in action so all we've got is we've got three and a half kilowatt of ballast down beside the bench we've got 1.75 kilowatt ballast in there uh, in the unit um, so you can do the maths and add that together that's got to be about five kilowatts something like that maybe a bit over maybe a bit under um, now the wiring, wiring configuration um, you might be able to see that from here I'm not going to tell you how I've done it because I don't want people to see if they don't understand but all I will tell you is that these are two transformers that are single pole the other pole is the earth so they are earthed together center tapped and they are out of phase if you understand that you understand that great if you don't learn more about it and you know all good um, but as I said I don't like telling people how it's done because you can go and buy one of these for three four hundred quid on eBay and uh, do it yourself so here we go right now I'm gonna move it up a bit and uh, this is it as you can see quite a substantial arc there so there's that um, I will attempt to widen it out a bit oh, have to excuse me got bad hair right I will attempt to widen it out a bit from over this side it's a bit warmer now so it's actually quite a bit easier and we'll try and uh, get it to actually make contact I don't want that wobbling around too much yes it is switched off just in case you're wondering I'm not quite that silly not unplugged, I do apologise but I can't really unplug my whole unit so we'll see what it does, I don't know if it'll work. As I say, this is the first test I've done myself, so... Oh yeah. Now I know you guys are going to want to be knowing how far apart this is. And unfortunately, the chance of me being able to find a tape measure, it's actually got a tool cabinet for um, Christmas as well pretty slim so what can I give you a guide with yeah, give you a guide with this this here I presume you can see me is a pen uh, from Andy Photon we've got just a bit less than that at the top of the gap you've got about well, just over two pens length um, I'll open it up a bit so we do. Don't try this at home, guys, because literally they're beamingly hot. Like beamingly hot. And say so these are ballasted. Um, at some point, oh, got this ballast here. I shall be connecting it up to the auxiliary ballast point and trying it out. But for today, this is what we're getting. Oh, I need my power button. As I say guys, this might not do anything because I haven't tried it myself yet. So there, 
Anyway guys, said I was going to do it. I've been wanting to do it myself for so long. Um, as I say, I'm so chuffed I've actually got to try it out myself now. I can confirm that gap at the top there, where it was just arcing over, is about two foot, maybe actually a bit longer, especially on the diagonal. I mean, yes, those transformers will give out a lot more power. If you consider I've run one of those transformers at seven kilowatts, uh, which you wouldn't want to be doing all the time, obviously. Um, but I've run, but I've run one of those transformers at seven kilowatts, so pretty much I could have theoretically put fourteen kilowatts through there. Um, but being ballasted to about five kilowatts, five and a half, can't can't work it out quite what it is. That three and a half down on the floor, one point seven five in there. That's uh, five point five, five point seven five kilowatts, something like that. Um, I could actually run that at you know double the power. Not for very long runs, of course. Um, they don't like it. They will heat up. I will just give it a little bit of over voltage. Um, you know, these things have to be done, don't they? And we'll see what they uh, perform like. I don't think there'll be too much difference, to be honest. I'm not cranking them right over. <laughs> but fun so yeah have fun guys enjoy your Christmas now we'll see you in the new year with some more action